consultation doesn't have to be perfect. It has to be done. So to do it is more important than putting it aside and letting it go. With our workforce being on the road and being mobile, it becomes a big challenge to try and get 40 truck drivers together within the one week to explain to them the issues, whether it be arising from other companies that we do work for, sites that we go to or within our own company. What we do with Toolbox Talks is um, an issue arises and we have to deal with that immediately. So we pretty well get on the phone straight away. We phone every driver discussing the issue and it's immediately dealt with. Because we are in a little country town at Walker and our trucks are running to the major cities, Walker's not always on route. So it is quite good just to have that interaction with the drivers. We really find it benefit like as a small company that it's giving you that one-on-one -on -one and that personal touch. Talking to every driver is important. It doesn't take up that much time to care about someone. It's actually a good feeling because we don't get left in the dark. We're sort of involved in the day-to-day -day steps and the running of the company so we know what we're up for. If we know that there is an issue coming up we all get time to plan and work out what we're going to do to fix it. If it's an issue that doesn't have to be dealt with immediately, we let them know there's a memo going to them. We give the drivers a hard copy of it in their pay slips. We also display it at our workshop sites and at our office up in Walker so that we get the guys that do come in. And then by talking to them, we find that at least we can sign off and we know that the best of their ability that they understand. We're currently trialling some iFace tablets in the truck. We're trying to achieve a paperless cab for the drivers. In there there's a section Easy Docs which we can put all their permits and everything in but we can also attach memos that we want them to get straight away. By having the safe work issues and resolving them through the guys, it's a lot like the trucks I suppose. If you're maintaining them, you're on top of everything, then everyone's happy and everyone's working and ready to work together and it's a place where people probably want to come and work because they know that things are going to get done and things are going to get fixed and that it's a safe place to be. Safety needs to be taken seriously because everyone wants to go home at night. This is just their job, this is their livelihood but their friends and family are more important.